Good morning. I go to this great dealership for my automobile maintenance. It's, it's, it's a tire store, but they have a really good team of people that work on things. And, and they watch out for me. They really do, because they know I don't watch out for myself. Because I, I have a tendency to just, well, I use the car to do what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to get me places and bring me back home safely. And so the, the guy yesterday very, very nicely, very gently let me down easy. He said, Bill, you know, you've, you've had these tires for 100 years, and, and you really are going to have to buy new tires for your car. It's, it's not safe. The rubber, <laughs> he actually said, the rubber may be falling off on the road one of these days. Okay, I'm in. I'm in. Yeah, I don't want, I don't want to be riding somewhere because I, I hadn't been going out of town in my car because I didn't think it was roadworthy to, to leave the city. It's probably not worth... Well, it is now. I'm here to say I, I, I got up off the money. I'm, I'm very proud of myself. I didn't I didn't argue about it. Well, hey, can you give it? No, no. Just do what you have to do because it's it's it was it was a, what I consider a lot of money for me. But when you consider buying a brand new car or even a, a, a used car, it wouldn't be the same. And plus, I love this car. It works perfectly. It does what it's supposed to do. So <laughs> I knew on um, I shouldn't be admitting this in public, but on the trip there yesterday morning. There was steam coming out of the front of the car. <laughs> I thought I had elected a pope.